Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to resolve if you're having touchpad sensitivity issues on your Windows 10 laptop or tablet device. So, if perhaps it's too sensitive to touch or perhaps it's not sensitive enough. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully go about resolving that issue without too much of a hassle. And we're going to go ahead and jump right into it. And we're going to start off by opening up the start menu. Just left on the start button one time. Type in regedit, so R-E-G-E-D-I-T. Best result should come back a registry editor. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, go ahead and select yes. Now before you proceed in the registry, I would suggest you create a backup of it. So if anything were to go wrong, you can easily restore it back. And in order to create the backup, it is very simple. You want to go ahead and select the file tab and then select export. File name should be the date in which you are making the backup. Export range, keep that at all and then save it to a convenient and easily accessible location on your computer or external device and then you just go ahead and select save once you're done naming it. So again, pretty straightforward, and if you ever need to import it back in, you would just select the file tab and then import, and navigate to the file location. So again, very straightforward. We're ready to begin, and we're going to start by double-clicking on the HK current user folder. So go ahead and double-click on that. Do the same thing now for the software folder. Same thing for Microsoft. Now locate Windows and go ahead and double click on that. Should be a current version folder under here. Go ahead and double click on that. Now again, we we're looking for something that says Precision Touchpad right here. And before you proceed, you might want to pause the video and take note of the file path up at the top of the screen here. Each backslash is a different folder we've gone under up to this point. So if you need to pause the video and take note in each backslash again is a different folder we have double clicked on to arrive at this point in the video. So anyway now that we're here on the right panel there should be something at the top that says AAP threshold. Go ahead and double click on that. So the value data in here can be anything from 0 to 3. So if you want to set it to 0 it's going to be the most sensitive. If you want to set it to 1 it's going to be high sensitivity. 2 is going to be medium sensitivity and the number 3 would be low sensitivity. So again 0 is going to be the most and 3 is going to be the least. So again that's going to be how you're going to change it. So perhaps it's too sensitive you want to go set it to a higher number. So low sensitivity would be 2 or 3. High sensitivity would be 0 or 1. Again the lower the number the higher the sensitivity. So I'm not actually going to change anything here because I'm not sure if you want to make it higher or lower. Again, that's going to depend on why you came to this video. But I'm just showing you guys how to do it. You would type the numerical number in as you see on my screen. Base should be hexadecimal and then you would select OK. You would need to restart your computer for the change to take effect. And that would be about it. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope that I was able to help you out and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.